Hi guys, welcome back to another review, and this time I'm reviewing, of course, the Amy Pond figure. I'm not gonna, uh, go through the packaging, because I've already reviewed it, so, I'm gonna cut, and I'm gonna open the figure. Okay, so, got the figure out. Uh, well, overall, it's not bad, I mean, people moaned at this figure for its detail lack, but... It is fantastic. It's probably the best Amy figure I've seen. I mean, especially for its small size, it's really detailed. I mean, you can't see it properly, so... I'm gonna cut and let you see it in more detail. And just look at it, I mean, the detail on this figure is beautiful. I mean... The hair and everything, it's just so detailed. I mean, the hair. It's got all the little pieces of, you know, like, where it's straight, you know, the hair strands. It's just really nice. And I absolutely love this figure. I mean, the promo pic, uh, not promo, the prototype pictures they released were really bad and it made it to look proper ugly. Um, but the figure's not actually that bad. So, moving down from her head, I mean, the eyes are painted well, the nose are painted well, and so is the mouth. So the details are really well. Uh, moving down from her head, you've got, like, a little bit of a uh, scarf or something. I think. I'm not actually sure what it is. It's a grey t-shirt, I believe. It does look green on camera, but it is grey, trust me. And then, obviously, you've got her black jacket as we go down. It's got the zip to the side and makes it look really cool. And obviously, she's got her arms there and her hands. The jacket's got a little pocket there. Um, and, nope, she's got a little bit of a pocket on the arm there. Uh, going down, she's got her grey skirt. Um, obviously, this figure is the one from Asylum and the Daleks, which I'm going to show you something at the end of this video, which I thought of doing. Um... Yes, yeah, so if you look, uh, you've got the skirt, the grey skirt with the nice buckles on it, and well, with the uh, the belt around it and the buckles, it's really nice, and obviously that goes all the way around. If you look at the back of the jacket where the hair comes down here, it's got wrinkle, uh, not wrinkle, creases in it to make it look more, well, better, and uh, the skirt's got little creases in it, but you can't really see it on that. And then she's just got plain black tights with some plain black boots, which you can't really see the detail on. So, can I focus a bit? There you go. Now, let's go on to the articulation. The head can do 360. Uh, you wouldn't have thought it, you thought you'd have thought it got hinged by the hair, but because it's this piece here has made a proper flimsy plastic, flexible plastic, it's quite easy to turn. Uh, the arm does, ugh, because this figure's new, it's like, 360 at the shoulder, it does 90, I think, because it's ball jointed, um, it does 360 at the bicep, does 90 at the elbow, and there is no risk articulation, the only thing you can do is bend the hand a little bit, but bend it, it doesn't stay, it goes back. So, and, and moving down, we've got 360 degrees at the waist, uh, 90 at the knee, and 360 degrees on the boot. So, overall, fantastic figure, absolutely love the detail on it. Now I'm just going to cut and I'm going to come back with the thing I wanted to do. And this is what I wanted to do and come back with. This is of course the iconic scene from the uh, Asylum of the Daleks cover. It's fantastic and you can now recreate that because we have a 3.75 inch Amy Pond figure. I absolutely love the Amy Pond figure. Now I want the 5 inch Clara which we are sort of getting. I mean we're getting the um, 5 inch Oswin Oswalds, but we kind of need a Clara ASAP. Um, 
to add to the collection, if you're a collector. But uh, Amy is definitely a good thing to add to the collection. Um, I've currently got about 13 of the um, 3.75 inch figures, which includes Wave 1, 2 and 3. Um, I only have two more to get of Wave 3 now. Um, I am trying to get the 12th Doctor. Uh, which one thing I actually noticed, um, when Pete Capaldi was on the one show on Friday, gone, was it? Yeah, on Friday gone, um, he was, well, yeah, I think it was Friday, he, um, he got given a figure in the new style packaging, and it was the new Doctor. But it wasn't this Doctor Who figure, as in this 12th Doctor that they're displaying on the back. It was one, it was exactly the same one as, um, as the one from Wave 2. So I don't know whether that was a one show mistake and it was a rare variant or I don't know. But, if you go watch the one show from last week, I might um, post some pictures from it and try and show you it on my The Doc Lemon Twitter account. But for now, this is me, signing out. Uh, yeah, goodbye for now. See ya.